Hello and welcome to Chef Lal's Kitchen. Today we are going to be making an Indo-Chinese recipe called Dragon Chicken. So let's get started. So the ingredients we need are 2 tablespoons of garlic paste, 1 and half tablespoons of ginger paste, 1 tablespoon of black pepper powder, 1 tablespoon of red chili powder, 1 tablespoon of garam masala powder, 2 chopped green chilies, some salt to taste, 2 tablespoons of tomato ketchup, 1 and half tablespoon of soya sauce. Then take 1 tablespoon of cornstarch with 3 tablespoon of water and make a paste of it. Then we need half cup sliced carrot, half cup sliced onion and half cup sliced capsicum. Then we need 500 grams of chicken, you can use boneless also of medium sized pieces. Then take the chicken in a bowl, add half of the garlic paste, the ginger paste, the black pepper powder, some red chili powder, then some garam masala powder, some salt, then give it a mix and set it aside for at least 30 minutes to marinate. Now in a pan, add 3 tablespoons of oil, then add all the chicken. Add some more oil if you need. Then cook the chicken for 12 to 15 minutes till it's completely done and transfer them into a bowl. Now while making Chinese dishes, have you ever thought like why when you try to cook a Chinese dish at home and did not get what you expected and something else is coming out of your wok? Well that may be a good food but not the same as you enjoyed at the restaurants. Well this is because the fundamentals of Chinese cooking are usually left out of the cookbooks like the real Chinese cooking is all about high flames as this will perfectly stir fry the ingredients and quickly. Now the burners we use at our homes are between 10 to 15 thousands of BTU. While the restaurants use the burners between 50 to 150 thousand BTU. Now the second thing is use as big wok as possible. If you don't have one, you can use your regular woks but don't add too much of ingredients and make it crowded. Now take a pan, add 3 tablespoons of oil, add the garlic paste, the ginger paste and the chopped onions. Of course I am making it in a high flame. Now add the chopped green chilies, the capsicum and the carrots. And cook for 1 to 2 minutes. Now for the spices, add the garam masala powder, the black pepper powder, the red chili powder, some salt to taste. Now the tomato ketchup, the soya sauce, now stir fry this for 2 minutes. Now it's time to add the chicken. Now mix well until each got fully coated with the sauce and the spices. 
After that, add the cornstarch paste we made. Mix well and let it cook for 1 to 2 minutes. Now it's done. So switch off the flame and it's time for plating. That's it. Dragon chicken is ready to serve. Don't just eat to live, live to eat. Thanks for watching. For more info visit my website and don't forget to subscribe.